Okay, in this lesson, I want to explain Boolean, spline Boolean here. Okay, there are deactivated now. We have to go into the top menu, for example, and <clears throat> insert to a spline. As I said before, in previous lessons, I explained all of them, and these are basic spline, and you can combine them with any spline together. For example, I insert to this spline and I want to combine them together and make a new the new spline shape. For doing that, we go into the spline menu and the boolean command. Click on this uh, dashed line and open the window in separate, right click, size to large to make to see them better. They are off now because you have to select at least two uh, spline to activate it. Click and drag and as you can see they are active. And here, as I mentioned before, uh, the color recognize the color is important here. As you can see, for example, in a we have the spline subtract. I want to <coughs> subtract a main spline. I want to, for example, subtract this flower from this uh, circle. My circle is a main object. And this is the second object that I want to extract from <coughs> circle. So when you click and drag, for example, select him, the last object that you selected is a, in a light orange. So the light orange is the main object. You can uh, select it. For example, if you have, uh, for example, if you have three circle, uh, two circle here, and you want to cut this flower and this circle from this main circle, you have to choose it at uh, <coughs> choose it choose it last. So click Control and Control click. As you can see, it's this circle that is in our main are in the, uh, at, in the last selection. And simply you hit spline subtract. As you can see our main circle uh, maintain and all of these two objects subtract from it. So the color is important here. I delete that. Or if you want to, this flower is the main, you select it last. As you can see, it's in a light orange and subtract. As you can see, the circle subtract from the flower. Okay, this is subtract. This is union. It's not important which object is last, which object the first, just union them. If you go into the model mo uh, point mode, as you can see, there are <clears throat> union and uh, new object. As you can see, if you uh, click on these tools, as you can see, the two object will be uh, re removed and create a new object. Uh, if you do that common, you cannot return back. Pay attention to that. In the next lesson, I want to teach you a spline mask that you can interactively doing that. Okay, you have to control Z to bringing back these splines. This is this is splines. Okay, another thing is AND. The AND uh, keeps the common part of the two intersection object. As you can see, if you hit the spline AND, it uh, cuts other part and keeps the common area of two spline that intersect to each other. This is AND. Or is exactly vice versa of that. If you click on it, it remove this area that the common, and you can know it, and you can understand what happened here. You have to go into generator, extra, extrude, and click and drag here. As you can see, all of the parts are uh, object, and here is a blank. In next route, I will teach you, don't worry, in here we have to go into the up vector. As you can see, we can make our model, okay? 
and control Z, control Z to return to the to this main object. And another comment is a spline intersect. This comment inter uh, this comment cut the object to from intersect points. Okay, uh, how we can show that comment? It's here. Uh, click uh, on one of these points, go into the select. We will teach this select option in detail, don't worry. And select connected. You can select the connected point to the, this point. Bring it up, and as you can see, intersect act, intersect common act like this. Another select, select connected, and as you can see, intersect act like this. Uh, create three object this is common area become a separate object and two other area become separate object from in intersect points okay and interesting part is that you can do, in, do it uh, spline, uh, spline uh, boolean comment in 3d for example we bring two circle with holding control and click and drag copy them and you can see they are not exactly on them they are on 3d so the boolean common act uh, from your camera from your camera angle click them and you can for example in this direction in this direction union them as as you can see in a 3d it's union union to this circle to each other or you can simply subtract them as you can see it's subtract in 3d that's interesting okay this is spline boolean so it's here in a spline and boolean common Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.